I know you thought you were going to be at that party tonight, not home putting your daughter's life back together, huh? Well, I'm a dad, Christine. My daughter's in pain. Can't think about how it screwed up my night. <laughs> Human, though. Given anything if you dumped her tomorrow morning. I am going to check on dinner. Hey, honey, I... You know, this thing with Kelly may... Well, it may turn into a... Uh, kind of a... A father-daughter huggy thing, you know? And you may feel a little awkward. Gee, I, I hadn't even thought of that. Maybe I should leave. No, 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 no. I want you to stay. It's, it's just that, well, uh, you know, if I sense Kelly's starting to get a little uncomfortable or something, I, I'll give you one of these. <laughs> uh, that'll be your signal. Leave us alone. <laughs> oh, that must be her. Look, honey, and why don't you grab a box of tissues, because I got a feeling my shoulder's going to be soaked in about two seconds. glass of water. Uh, maybe we should sit on the couch? Sure, yeah, let's go do sit there. Yeah. another man as long as I live. Oh, man, come on, Kelly. You're gonna, you're gonna meet someone. You know what they say. You gotta get back up on that horse. You're my little buckaroo, right? I was in a marriage, not a rodeo. your age, I was dating a girl by the name of Brenda Claybuckle. Daddy, and... please don't tell me a story about you getting dumped. Okay. <laughs> hey, what about if I gave you some money? You go out and get some new clothes or something, huh? <laughs> Can I just be alone with Christine for a little while? It's all right, Hayden. We'll be fine. 